Hello and welcome to the Ultra Spin video series. Knowing what type of oil is in your oily water is critical for selecting the correct separator system. There are four main types of oil that we're going to go through in today's video. They are free oil, emulsified oil, dissolved oil and heavy oil. Different oil types require different separation methods. And because in most circumstances there's going to be multiple types of oil in your oily water, you need to apply a different treatment strategy for each of the oil types that is present. So firstly we have free oil. Free oil will usually float to the top because it involves oil droplet sizes of 150 micron or larger. It is fairly easy to deal with free oil as there are many solutions to this problem. Next we have emulsified oil. Emulsified oil can make the oily water look very cloudy because the oil is so intimately mixed with the water. Emulsified oil includes oily water droplet sizes from 2 to 150 micron and because the droplet size is so small it requires a much more powerful separator and gravity based systems are going to do very little. Dissolved oil encompasses three different things. Firstly there are oil droplets that are smaller than 2 micron. Secondly we have detergents and other cleaners. And thirdly soluble hydrocarbons such as benzene and toluene. Keep in mind, biological activity can turn insoluble oil into soluble oil over time. These three components have been grouped together because they have similar treatment options and cannot be removed by mechanical separators or gravity-based systems. Heavy oil is oil with a density that is greater than water, but also includes light oil that has become stuck to solids. Because of its weight, it sinks to the bottom rather than floating and therefore it requires a different treatment method than the other oil types. There's not one separator that's going to be able to deal with all four types of oil. So for example, a separator that deals with free oil well might struggle with emulsified oil and heavy oil. And in real life, oily water is going to have multiple types of oil in it and you're going to need to apply a different treatment strategy for each of the types of oil that is present in your water. Uh, if you're having trouble determining what types of oil are in your water, then feel free to give us a call. So now we're going to go through some real life samples that we've gathered in the field and then analysed in our lab. This first sample comes from a fuel farm and you can see straight away there's a pretty thick layer of free oil on top and the mixture is not that cloudy so there's a little bit of emulsified oil. And then if we look at the bottom, there's not really any heavy oil. And when we analysed this one, we found that there was a lot of dissolved oil present. This next sample comes from a mine site and it's basically got everything. So we can see our layer of free oil on top and then throughout the mixture it's very cloudy which means that there's going to be a lot of emulsified oil. And if you look at the bottom, you can also see some heavy oil has settled out. And when we analysed it, we found that there was some dissolved oil. And this final sample is from a dairy. So again, we can see this free oil layer on top, but in this case it's fat. And then throughout the mixture, there's quite a lot of emulsified oil. And when we look at the bottom, there's not really any heavy oil. And when we analysed it, we found that there was a lot of dissolved oil in it. As you can see from these three samples, every application is going to be different and so it's important that you get your oily water analysed to determine what types of oil are present. At Ultraspin this is something that we're happy to do for you and if you'd like some more information please check out the downloads page or learning centre on our website. Thanks for watching.